In this video, I'm going to be attempting to list 85 used pairs of shoes on eBay. What is up, guys? Camps Kicks here, bringing you guys another video. In this video, I'm going to be attempting to list 88 used pairs of shoes on eBay. I used to only list my shoes on Instagram and Goat. Lately, shoes haven't been selling very fast on Goat. And the seller fees are pretty high. It's 9% plus 3% plus $5. So any sneaker that you list on eBay for over $100, there's no seller fees except the 3% from PayPal. So that's definitely really nice. And eBay is one of the biggest selling platforms out there, if not the biggest one. There's definitely a lot more people looking at shoes there. So I think it's just a great selling avenue. So I'll be updating you guys throughout the process. It's pretty late. It's 1.30 in the morning. So I'll be up all night listing shoes. So stay tuned to watch the process. So I'm just going to go shoe by shoe and take pictures of it as I'm listing it. So the first one I'm going to start with is right there. It's in Barcelona 7, size 10 and a half. So I'm about to list that one. So I just got done listing my first couple pairs. This is the third pair I'll be listing. So the first thing I do before I list it is I make sure to inspect the shoe for any flaws. And I'll be including those flaws in the description. You want to make sure to be as detailed as possible to avoid any problems with the buyer. So I just inspected these. The only main flaw that I saw was some creasing. And then the box is damaged. So I'll make sure to include both of those things in the description. And now I'm about to show you how I list them. So stay tuned for that. So I just clicked selling. Now I'm going to hit active. And I currently have two active listings. So now I'm going to go back and I'm going to click list an item. And it's going to ask you to describe this item. So it's a Jordan 10 Westbrook. So I'm going to type in Westbrook 10. And it's going to come up with more results. So the final result that I type in is Air Jordan 10 Russell Westbrook. So it's going to find similar listings that already exist. So I'm just going to find one that best suits mine. And then I'll have a format for listing it. So then I choose one and I hit sell yours. And then mine's pre-owned, so I select pre-owned for the condition. Now I'm just going to edit the title a little bit to what I want it to say. So the next thing I'm going to do is edit the description a little bit. So after pre-owned, I'll disclose any flaws it may have. So for this one, I'll put creasing and regular wear. And then I'll also make sure to mention that the original box is included. And that it has a little bit of damage. So then I'll scroll down the pricing. And I'll turn off auction because I just want to buy it now price. Now there's no eBay seller fees but there's still the 3% PayPal fee. So just keep that in mind. And then I want to turn off offers just so I don't get any low offers. So the last thing that I need to do is edit the shipping. So me personally, I just make the shipping free and incorporate that price into what I sell the shoes for. So then after that, everything's all set. And now I just need to go back in and add the photos. So for this listing, I'm going to take the photos live on here. So I'll show you guys how that looks. So the first picture that I take is of the shoes on their sides with the outers facing up. So I just arrange this photo kind of diagonally and then I take it vertically. So I'm setting this up and then this is how I take it right here. So then after that photo, I'm going to keep the shoes on top of the box and I'm going to take a photo of the uppers like this. So then the next photo is of the back of the shoes. So I'll be taking a picture of the heels and this is how this one looks. Then I take a photo of the bottom of the shoes. So I'll flip them over and I'll either put them on the box or next to the box. Then the next photo I take is of me holding the shoe. And then I'll take some pictures of the flaws. So for this one, it's creasing like I already mentioned. So I'll take some pictures of that. And then if the box is damaged, I'll make sure to take a picture of the top of the box. And then I also take a picture of the box label. Then you just have to wait for the photos to upload. Now you can do this while you're editing the description or whatever if you upload the pictures first. So then once they're uploaded, you're all set. So you just scroll down to the bottom and you click list your item. For easy pricing, you can click maybe next time. Then no thanks to promote it. Then you hit done. So you're all set and you should get the email confirmation. So now I have three listings. The next one I'll be uploading is these Oxford 10 Yeezy 350 V1 size 9. So I'll update you guys once this one's listed. Just finished this one, so I sped this up a lot, but this is how the photos look. So I just got done listing my sixth pair. It's actually the next day. I got pretty tired yesterday, so ended up going to bed and starting over today. So for the rest of them, I'm just going to take pictures of all of them. 
And then once I have all the pictures of the shoes, once I have all those pictures, then I'm just going to upload them. So I'll update you guys as I'm taking the pictures. So what I'm going to actually do is I got this whole first row. I either have pictures taken of them or them listed already. So six of them are listed. And then I took pictures of four of them. So I'm going to take pictures of 10 more. And then I'm going to upload the 14 that I haven't uploaded yet. So then I'll have 20 listings after that. And I'll keep going in systems of 10 from there. So here's the next 10 pairs I'll be taking pictures of. And then after that, I'll have 14 pairs that I have pictures of, but just not listed. So then once I list those 14 pairs, I'll have a total of 20 listings. So I'll update you guys once I have pictures of all of these taken. Just got four more uploaded, so I have 10 listings now. And now I have a total of 20 listings. It's been a little bit later. Just took photos of 10 more pairs, about to list those. 30 pairs are now listed. So here's 12 more I'm about to take pictures of. And then once I have these pictures, I'll upload them. And once those are all uploaded, I'll have 42 uploaded. So that's about halfway. Now I either have all these listed or at least pictures taken of them. So these 12 right here, I just have the pictures taken. So I'm about to list them. So I'll update you guys once those are all listed. It'll be 42 pairs listed after these. I now have 42 pairs listed. So I'm about to take pictures of these eight. And then once I list these, I'll have 50 pairs listed. So I might stop there for today. I'll update you guys once I start doing more. All right, so 50 pairs are now listed. And I'm going to stop there for tonight. All right, so today's the next day. I got 10 more pairs right there. I'm about to take pictures of them. And then I'm going to list them. So then I'll have 60 pairs listed once I get these listed. So I'll update you guys once these are all set. Just got those listed, so I now have a total of 60 pairs listed. So as you just saw, I have 60 pairs listed. So that means I have 25 more pairs to take pictures of. So I got these eight pairs right here. And then I have 17 pairs over there that don't have a box. Then every other pair over there, those are all brand new pairs, the ones that have boxes over there. So I won't be uploading the brand new pairs today. So I'm about to take the pictures of these 25. I'll update you guys once everything's all listed. So I actually sold two pairs here on eBay. The first one was a black metallic 5, size 8.5. It sold for $279.99. And I also sold these black toe 14, size 10.5. I had them listed at $269.99. And the buyer messaged me and asked if I could do $240. So I sent them an offer for $250 and they accepted it. The last time you guys saw how many pairs I had listed was 60. Now I have 50. Two sold on eBay, as you can see right there. And then one pair sold on GOAT, so I had to completely delete that pair. And then the other seven unsold right there. I marked them to unsold because I sold a $3,000 package deal. And that had 17 pairs in it. So out of the 17 pairs, two were brand new, so I wasn't going to list them on eBay. That leaves me with 15 pairs. So seven out of the 15 pairs I had already listed. So I just marked those to unsold. And then the other eight pairs, I just saved the photos because he had only sent $1,000 and I was just waiting for him to send the other $2,000 before I delete everything. So I'll update you guys in the next video and I'll show you all my sales. So that leaves me with 17 more pairs to upload. So that's a total of 67 pairs that I'll have listed once this video is finished. All right, so I'm finally done. I have 67 pairs listed. So that's going to do it for this video. And the next clip is going to be the outro. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to like, comment, and share this video. And if you're not already subscribed, please make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And if you're not already following me on Instagram, please make sure to follow me on Instagram at camskicks.sc. Thank you guys and have a great night.